Hey guys! Today we have for you our favorite winter lips. Basically, we're just going to be going over our favorite lipsticks, what colors we like to wear in the winter, and we're just going to be showing you our favorite combinations and lipstick or lip pencil and lipstick or lip stain or literal lipsticks. So let's get into it. Okay, so... <laughs> oh, I'm being so goofy. All right, She's so... Drunk. The first color that I have to show you all is my Melted Too Faced lipstick. And I just really like the consistency. It doesn't stay on as long as I would like it to, but what I've learned is that if I prep my lips with a matte, it stays on a lot longer. And it, the finish is way prettier. And the combination that I've created is actually with my Urban Decay 24 7 lip pencil in the color Venom. I do believe. Yes, Venom. It's like a pretty berry. And it's a little deeper than the actual Too Faced Melted Lipstick, but the combination is oh so awesome. This is my favorite lipstick at the moment. It's the Wet n Wild, the <laughs> Wet n Wild Mega Last, but it's in the color Mocha Licious. I am in love with this color. This is my number one. This is my number one. So next is my NYX. Simply Vamp, and actually it's all like crazy now because I use it too much, but um, it's the Simply Vamp in the color 2, and actually the name of it is Temptress, Temptress 2, and it's really just this really pretty purple color, it's awesome, it's matte, finishes matte, goes on kind of glossy, but the the finish is definitely matte and it actually reminds me of a matte cyber and what I pair this with is my NYX um, lip pencil in the color dark brown. Okay next I have this OCC. Um, it was in one of the videos that I did. Mm -hmm. I don't know what that video was called but it was in my, one of my videos. Holiday look. Holiday look. The frozen holiday look. Let's go. <laughs> okay, it's the OCC in Sebastian. This bees the bomb. I like this a lot. I love the color. That's why I like it so much. Um, as far as the consistency, it is a little wet and slippery. But when I put when I lined my lips with um, this NYX pencil in Sweet Bean, it was okay. The one I got was kind of like, I don't know what was wrong with it. It was like it was separated or something, the color and the oils inside of it. So I think that's why I was having such a hard time. But I think this would look great on olive, olive skin tone. Mm -hmm. Skin tone. Definitely yellows. fair. Definitely fair. Yeah. But um, it's like brown skins and fair. This skins. is a good color it, because it has like it's like a a mix of like it, it it has like turquoise in it. You know the blue and then the red mm -hmm. and then like some white too. It's like a taupey kind it, of. It's a good color. Get it. Okay, so my next fave, it's another NYX product, and it's actually from the Macaron Lippy line in the color Shambord. It's a black, and it's just really edgy to me. Like, I like black lipsticks because it kind of, it's a poppy color without being poppy, if that makes sense. Like, it's not bright, but it stands out, and it's really edgy. And it's just a fun color. The reason why I like this is because of, first of all, the price. And secondly, because it, it it dries matte. As you know, in most of our videos, we talk about matte lipsticks all the time. And we're serious about it. 
So this definitely a go-to if you're looking for black lipstick. My next color is in Enamored. SV01 Enamored by NYX. It's the Simply Vamp Lip Cream in the Lip Natural Lipstick. I love this color. This color is so pretty. It complements my skin very well. And instead of it just being like a dark lip, it has like these metallic like reflex of gold in it. It's just amazing. It would be something to make your, your lips look bigger. Mm -hmm. I love this. It's just like the, the reflex in the lipstick. It just picks up really well in the light. I really love this lipstick. And I'm not, I mean, I like dark lips not necessarily on me. I like dark lips on other people. So that's what makes me buy like a dark lipstick. Say, oh, that really looks good. Hey, what is that? And then I'll go ahead and buy it. But I don't particularly like dark, dark lips on me. Yourself, yeah. But this dark lip right here, I love this. Okay, so my next fave is a MAC lipstick in the color Cyber. Okay, Cyber, everybody knows about Cyber or everybody should know about Cyber. Um, it's been around for a minute and I've actually had it for a minute which is why it's at the end but it's just <coughs> a really pretty deep dark purple if you're going for the vampy look just like the other NYX uh, Simply Vamp product that I showed you it's literally almost the same color except it's a satin finish and I'm not one to go for the satin finishes only because it rubs off so fast and glossy on me I guess because I've gotten so used to matte it just looks funny, but something about that cyber, it just does something to me. It just makes me feel like, Rawr. but um, yeah, I like me some cyber. It's the move. They still sell it, so if you want to get it, go get it, because I suggest it. Next. I'm not your typical winter color, but I just love this lipstick. It's like, it's, it's an NYX lipstick, it's an indie but flick, it's nothing special. It looks like this because of my little one, but and now you, right? <laughs> but it's indie flick. It's like on me. It comes off. It's like, like an orange, orange red. red. It's like a hot neon red, but on me it comes off orange. I love this color. It's pretty it complements my skin and it's just fabulous. It just, yeah, it's like it's fabulous. There you go. It's fabulous. My next lippy is an OCC Lip Dark. This is a really deep red, and I know red is like typical uh, winter color, but um, I just really, really, really like this color. I think it's like deep red or so. I don't remember the name because um, it's not on here, but the only thing that's actually on here is MS. FW. So if you're looking for that, type that in and look for it. Um, it is like one of the older ones, but uh, it's just a really, really, really pretty red. And when you prime, like not even prime your lips, if you prep your lips with a base color like a lip pencil or a matte lipstick or so, you should be fine with it, you know, not rubbing off or anything like that. I actually prep my lips with a Bare Minerals pencil. It's in the color Amp and it's like a deep red. Actually, it's just like a, it's something like a ruby blue, kind of, sort of. Um, but it's just a lip pencil. And I place this on top, and it just has a really nice finish. I guess we can both talk about this because it's both our fave lip for the winter. Mine is messed up. <laughs> Centerfold by Lorac. Yes. Their alter ego lipsticks. I don't even want to wind mine up okay <laughs> no seriously this is what my lipstick looks like after <laughs> GMS gets to it anyway yes this is I like this lip color it's like um, the last nude that I actually bought had to be like a long time ago and it was actually my first nude and I was like in love with it Actually, what was it? It was Myth by Mac. It's so and yellow. Yeah. It's such a yellow. It just, it just really doesn't do anything for me. And this is a, it has a bit more brown in it. Right. 
what it's like peach brown yeah it's like, like a bobby peachy nude everything nude. is mauve to her no it isn't it. no it <laughs> but <laughs> this is a really nice nude for me and as you can see nico she's a bit darker than me and it still even compliments her it's like the perfect color for when you're on the go and just need something to put on your lips or even when you're trying to go out and you know you need a nude or so it's like the perfect nude my color in character, in character. like in a disney like a movie this would be my color okay <laughs> <laughs> but if you're looking for a little rock lipstick and alter ego line i would suggest centerfold for that so my next one is actually also a Wet n Wild Mega Last lipstick in the color Cherry Bomb. I like it because it's like your perfect plum. It's inexpensive and you can't go wrong with matte ever. Duh. It definitely has a matte finish and honestly I bought it not necessarily because of the color but because of the price. It has become one of my fave winter lipsticks though, as well as fall. It reminds me of a purpler Diva, because Diva has like a red face. More red. Yeah. Opposed to this one, it's a lot more purple. What if you were put, to put them side to side, side to side, it would be similar. It stays, it's true to its name, Megalas, but while you did that, and it's just, it's good for mixing colors as well. I'd mix it. I've mixed it with the dark brown that I've been talking about all video um, before, but it goes good by itself as well. So, can't go wrong with the price. $199, $198, like two bucks. Come on. So, yeah. If you can find it in your nearest drugstore. If you can't, just go to drugstore.com and pick up some. Because they're just as inexpensive. So yeah, the next one is by MAC. It is the Saint Germain lip gloss. I actually have it on right now. So pretty. <laughs> this and my center fold my good old I like this. This is it's pretty color. It's like a pale pink and like a neon pink put together. Oh, it's like bright, but still pale. I like it. I am a fan of, when it comes to gloss, I am a fan of, I am a fan of MAC lip glosses. This is a lip glass, I didn't know, but um, I'm a fan of MAC lip glosses. Because it's thick. Because it I like stays. thick and they like stay and the color shows yeah. and they're good. Is another Simply Vamp lipstick. Literally, it's a stink <laughs> by NYX or NYX. Uh, it's in the color SVO4, and the name of the actual tube is Bewitching. It's the bomb.com. It's a really pretty plum. It's it's a it's a maroon, and actually, you can tell I've been mixing things. I actually, have it on right now, and I mixed it, of course, with my favorite pencil, dark brown. Uh, I put this all over my lips and then I applied this, which is why it has more of a a chocolatey tone to it opposed to like the actual maroon. Um, but you can wear it with a pencil, without the pencil, with a pencil close to the color. You know, mixing is your best friend. It can't be because it's my best friend. But um, yeah, I like it by itself or with the dark brown either way. It's just a really pretty maroon. Seriously, they have been on the come up for a while. Like, they've been, they've always been a good brand as far as um, not being priced so high. Mm -hmm. But lately, I just really like all of the lines that they've come out with, and especially the Simply Vamp. It's a perfect line. Uh, they have Simply Red too, I believe. But Simply Vamp is perfect for the fall and winter. It's these really pretty vampy purples and plums and maroons and they the one seriously so that was one of my faves my last one is a matte lipstick from Atlantix um uh in the color merlot i really like this color 
I really do like it's so pretty to me it's the closest thing I do not have Poe by Rihanna this is the closest thing that I can find to it it's really close but it's it's close I think I'm trying to like it too much too it's because it's, it's close to that color it's a bit more red but still it's it's a good one but it finishes matte it's really really pretty it's like it's not too much and that's what I like about Ho it's not too much but it's like just enough it's like it's a really nice color it's it's an eye catcher but it's not like too, it's yeah. just not too like much. Like you can but stand out in the crowd in a good yeah, way. Yeah, it's like, it, yeah, it stands out in a good way. There yeah. you go. That's what I like about this. Like, it's not too bright. Like, with a red lipstick, if you're wearing red, it's like, sometimes it can be too much. Yeah, or sometimes it, it's, it, it can, you know, be a little overboard. Yeah, it's like, it always has to be like at the right time. Oh, am I doing too much with this red lip? Like, right. that's what I like about this tone. Like the matte with the... The NYX. I really like this formula. I really, really like this formula. It stays. It sticks. It shows. Sorry. I like this a lot. And that's it for me. My last and final one is a MAC <laughs> lipstick. It is one that has recently, well not recently, recently, but just became a part of the full-time that MAC lipsticks and it is heroin. I remember when this first came out and I was like, you know, on the border, like, yeah, on the fence, seeing if I really wanted it or not. I was like, oh, it's a purple. Not really sure because I had goes and goes and that was like the only purple I was like sticking to with MAC. I was like, no, no more purples. It's the only one. And I was like, it may not fit my skin tone. It may. Because I'm really weird when it comes to lipsticks. I have a lot, but it's... I don't like all colors on me. And... It sold out. And I was like, okay, you know what? That's a good thing it sold out. Because that helped me with my decision. I'm like, I'm not going to get it. So then, I saw that my cousin had it. And she's a makeup artist as well. And she let me try it on. Because she had been trying to get it. She let me try it on. She was like, oh, you need to try this. And I was like, okay. And I tried it. And I was like, oh, I kind of like this. Oh, I should have got it. So, so, so. so when it came back out, I was like, okay, got to get it. And it became permanent. So I was like, okay, fine. But I really like it. It's a really pretty purple. It's like a deep, not even a deep purple. It's, it's just purple, I guess you could say. It's like, it's like a pinkish purple. It's like fuchsia mixed with purple. Yeah, exactly. Very. It looks like Barney, but um, the color. Yeah. You know what color Barney is? <laughs> exactly. It's like a fuchsia purple. Uh, it's actually my best friend's favorite color. Like she wears this all the time. We have to her. Switch it up. But um, I like it too, and it's really similar to Riri Boy um, from the Rihanna line, except for Riri Boy, it's a little, it's a retro matte. But uh, this is matte as well. Love our matte. And it's the bomb, so pick it up if you want a really nice, different, fun, edgy, but toned down purple as well. That's it, guys, for our favorite winter lipsticks. We hope that you enjoyed. See you next time. Don't so forget. don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and keep watching our channel. <laughs> of course. And don't shoot ever, ever, ever forget be your, your own, own kind, kind of beauty. beauty.